morning guys so what we're doing today is we're gonna actually try to hook up the wood stove <laughs> take 75 <laughs> okay so what ended up happening was they sold me the wrong piece so when they sold me this piece they sold it for single wall and I'm doing everything in double wall so I don't know why she gave me this same company, same people, dealt with everybody at the same time. Um, we went back to get a different piece, and they're completely sold out for the year, apparently. I don't know when they're going to get more in. Uh, so we went ahead and got a single piece, single wall, that we're going to then connect into the triple wall. So we can use what we have, and we can actually get wood going. It is something that we will be changing out a little bit later. But since we're going up against all non-combustible material, it will be fine for now. We also have to find some insulation that's fire rated, um, basically the same stuff that they insulate stoves with or whatever, but that we can stuff around there um, to block that hole because we won't be able to insulate all that um, like we want to or block it all in like we want to because it has to be non-combustible material. So. We're just going to get this up here so that we can start heating this area so that we can start get some heat and as soon as they have the part that we actually need we'll pull it all down cool it all off pull it all down and do it right but we got to get some heat it's cold it's going into the 20s so this is what we're doing so don't attack me and kill me in the comments <laughs> it's not my fault <laughs> I'm going to need more hands because this is going to fall. This is going to end up going like that. And this needs to be pulled out. this is absolutely not the way that you're supposed to put the wood stove in so we probably shouldn't show you we should just tell you it's done but we are trying to be real so we're gonna show you what we do <laughs> I do not recommend you doing it uh, we are gonna have to come back and change it up later whenever we have the right stuff um, but we're screwing it directly to the metal and uh, we're gonna have some stuff um, soldered together, welded together, a frame welded, and then we'll be putting that on and we'll be doing it right. We just got to get it up now.
I want to tell you what, we laugh at ourselves too. So I hope you're laughing. Because <laughs> we just realized that this part goes down against the house, not up against the thing. And we got a whole bunch of snow on it. So, we got to put these on here. Good. Yeah, just learning to do what we have to do. This is not a how-to video, so if you came here to learn how to do this, back away. <laughs> Just remember that we're funny. <laughs> and kind. And kind. Nope. You know, I know um, some people in the comments can be mean. Uh, we just ignore you if you're mean. Just saying. <laughs> but... Uh, in general, everybody is really nice, and I don't mind learning in front of people because I just want people to know that it's okay to do it wrong and learn how to do it right. I mean, that's how I learn how to do things. Um, by trial and error, so you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna have to, I'm gonna have to figure out where this goes and put little dots and drill again. Go in where the they go up on the wall. Oh. I have no idea where it goes. <laughs> I don't know. Don't ask me questions like I should know. <laughs> yeah. So. That's official. That's an official term. <laughs> I need a pokey bit. I need a pokey your bit. <laughs>
just in the wrong way.
the cap on the, can they put a cap on it? Let's go move our shelf one more time, three times a charm. See how many holes I can drill into my shipping container. And FYI, if you know how to fill those holes <laughs> so that the water doesn't run all in, let me know in the comments. Look at this view, guys. Is that not the most spectacular thing you've ever seen? Gorgeous. We better get back to work. We don't want the boss to be mad. Stop lollygagging, looking at that beautiful sunset. Get back to work. Oh, there she is. Sorry, I took our friends for a view of the amazing view. It's stunning. Okay. But what's not stunning is the fact that this is in the wrong place. <laughs> yeah, well, let's try this again. Luckily, I know someone who could weld and could fill in these holes. <laughs> and he said he could weld. And hopefully, we'll be able to just put it right up at the next one. And I don't know if you guys can hear me because the generator's going on. I may have to blurb all this out. <laughs> So we have to have the generator going to fill our water. I said earlier off camera. <laughs> Persistence piece off. Covered. <laughs> but 
But I think we have a starter log that I'm gonna chop up and we'll get a fire started and we'll see how this actually pulls out before I screw everything in because that's what it says to do in the book. So let me get that into a couple pieces and then we'll try to start it. We have no idea what cut off you get what you get. Good night everybody. This is really a stressful <laughs> day. Trying to stay positive. We'll see if we can get this lit and bring you a fire. Uh, so fingers crossed for that. We appreciate you. We appreciate you. Good night. Good night. Hey you guys, I don't know if you can tell or not, but the smoke's definitely coming up and out. Come out a little, Kim? No, out towards the RV? Yeah. Okay, I can see it. Hold on, towards the shipping container. You see that movement, you guys? That smoke. Let's go see what's happening on the inside. I call that a win. <laughs> we got fire, we got smoke going out the way that it's supposed to be going. There's none coming on the inside. Uh, we have a few extra holes in the container, but we're calling those venting holes. <laughs> <laughs> so right now I'm just got my lawn chair hanging out. With your bestie. With my bestie. <laughs> And we're going to watch this fire, but we are going to call it a night, and we're in a much better mood. At least I am. Kim stayed in a good mood. So, thanks, you guys. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs>